Okay, it is time for the Boston South Station Grand Finale, the Greenbush Line. Although not the most exciting line, it's still the last one as I worked my way from right to left and got all these guys. So without further ado, let's get started on it. Just going to get a little side view from this side here because we are finishing up at South Station for a while. Alright, and off we go, the farthest to the left line. So first up, JFK UMass. Uh, this one is on the appropriate commuter rail uh, theme track here. So just the high level platform with the uh, overhead shelter as we've seen before. And if you want to get to the other two lines, you walk over to where the red line would be to get to the Kingston, Plymouth, and Middleborough Lakefield lines. Explored enough in the Middleborough Lakeville line video, so I will leave it at that. And then we come up on Quincy Center. On it's uh, located on the uh, what is it? The north, the inbound towards Alewife side. On the red line, even though it's actually supposed to be over here. Jeez, come on. Get it together, man. Over here on the commuter rail platform is where it would actually be in reality, but this one was dedicated to the Middleborough Lakeville line. And like with JFK UMass, I've explored this one enough, so I'm just going to leave it at that. Get one little final shot in there and then head on out. Up here is where it splits off from the Kingston, Plymouth, and Middleborough Lakeville lines here to continue out on its own. So first stop is way out here on the line, uh, just past the village because I wanted to put it on ground level at least somewhat. Uh, this station is located half below, half at ground level, so you'll see what I did in a minute here. So for this station, it's a high level platform all the way through partially in a tunnel. Uh, you can enter it on ground level from this side after coming downstairs from uh, the other side. So there's a roadway up here and you would look down onto the tracks beneath you with the parking lot uh, actually elevated up here. But I've just put a staircase in to uh, cross between this side and that side. So you come down along along the platform here, come up onto it. Uh, this is a uh, Weymouth Landing East Braintree, by the way. I forgot to say which one it was. But there is a tunnel section of it underneath the bridge here, and then the rest of the exposed platform. Not conveniently located for the villagers, as they do have to walk a pretty good distance to get to it, but nonetheless, here it is. East Braintree, Weymouth Landing. This one is much more conveniently located for this village, which is pretty close by. Good news is the other village that was over there was an abandoned village, and this one is not an abandoned village, so less of an inconvenience over there as no one really lives there. But still good to explore if you want to. Anyway, this is the station for East Weymouth. So one high-level platform on the right coming outbound with the high level shelter portion of it and this one is um, basically located up against the parking lot so looking at it like this is how it would pr pretty much be in real life uh, to get to the village uh, you can take let's see what did I do I know I put something in here I believe I put a fence up so you couldn't get to it oh yeah over here so over here is how you get to the village. A little sign here, you just go underneath the uh, the tracks here, and you can get over here. Nothing like that in real life, it's just a parking lot up against the platform, but... To the villagers, I just wanted to be nice to them, and to make it easy for people to get to it. So, station's located up there, on the village. And there's a little aerial shot of it.
And finally, after coming through all these uh, swamp lands, we get to the next stop. So this one is West Hingham. Uh, pretty close to how it looks in real life here as well. Uh, the station is located right right up against the parking lot, so you can just walk right onto the station platform. Uh, there is another there is an extended uh, sidewalk that leads down to the railroad crossing and road uh, looking this way in real life. I did not include that, just put the station here with the uh, overhead shelter portion. So another very simple one. Pretty much as simple as that. And after we come out of this tunnel, we get to our next stop, Nantasket Junction. Uh, another pretty simple platform, high level with the uh, overhead shelter, so same as the rest. High level shelter is located at the uh, this end of the platform here, coming outbound. And this one is not up against a parking lot, but the parking lot is nearby. You just walk up a staircase to get to it, uh, and then you walk over to the platform, not onto it directly like this, but... Just for the sake of where the topography was, I just put the staircase leading up to it right here. And then after this, I introduce a little right turn here to uh, indicate where the tracks start to turn south again along the East Massachusetts coastline. And that brings us to Cohasset. Just another high level platform with a shelter area. So you can just walk right onto it. This one is also, this one is located up against a parking lot if I remember correctly. Most of them are. Um, pretty sure it's, pretty sure it's just level with it. But anyway, that's as simple as it gets for this one, just the uh, platform and the shelter. Easy access. Alright, now coming up on North Situate, second to final stop. Um, this one is only slightly elevated above the parking lot, like just by one little step for a staircase. Um, but due to the topography differences, I put in a much larger staircase to get up to it. So you just come up the stairs like such. And you got the platform high level with the two shelter areas. So another very simple one. probably make it easier to get to that stair, so I'm going to do that. There we go. And moving on to our final stop. Come by some pretty cool cliff sides. This is way out over the ocean, so this is a big difference. Uh, in distance between North Situate and Greenbush than in reality. I've got a cool little lava spill going on over there. And finally come to this tunnel. And I did put a little uh, kind of window thing through this to look out a uh, waterfall coming over. Cliff side here. Finally, way out here on the land, we get to the final stop of Greenbush. So, simple platform. Uh, it is level with a parking lot, so you can just hop on anywhere. And high level uh, boarding area, uh, platform overall with the shelter. 
And then the line terminates right here, doesn't go any further. Doesn't have any more tracks or anything, just a train yard. And that is Greenbush and the Greenbush line. So that concludes all the South Station MBTA branches. Now there's a village nearby too, forgot about that. But yep, that concludes all the South Station MBTA branches. I will continue construction on the North Station ones, and eventually, once those are finished and I'm satisfied with what they look like, I will release a video there. Um, I probably will release an extra video of the shuttle between South and North Station, and then show off North Station in a single video. That way, I don't have to spend too much time on it when I start showing off the other branches. So for now, that's about it. And I will see you in the next one.